Hello and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included Space Out Edition here on the Seven Kingdoms Colony. Alright, so in the last episode we were working on multiple things. One, uh, building out an area here for some bog buckets, which we could actually start planting. How about that? Cool. Um, and finishing the piping so that we can get some, some decently cooled water over there. And then we also started this and what we're gonna do is i just i i thought about this if we're doing this all wrong to get the algae over here there is an easy way because all we need is like 10 kilograms of algae per block that's it that's all we need so we are going to destroy all those how are we going to do that? We're going to use some automated shipping. So we're just going to take this thing. Uh, we'll just stick it right here. We will take this conveyor meter. As I was looking through stuff. Just stick it right there. And then one at a time, we will build out these things. Right? Uh, we're just going to do one at a time. Uh, and then, of course, we need... Um, a conveyor rail to go through. So we're just going to go like that to there. And we're going to go all the way down to over here. And we need automation to tell us how much stuff to send through this thing, I believe. I think. What type of automation is it? No. Conveyor germ sensor. I think it's an element sensor. Is what we need. I'm not sure. We'll, we'll build it. Take a look at what it, what options are in it. Um, yeah. And of course, we gotta get power to it. Which is not a problem. There we go. Alright. <clears throat> so we'll get... We'll figure this out. Anyways, um... So, we've got the bog buckets. Um... Water is at 27. That's good. Body temperature is at 37. Oh, it's too hot up here. And I didn't even... Silly me, I didn't check that. Well... <clears throat> I do have 31,000 in ice. Maybe we can just... Cool this area down a little bit. Why not? Alright, uh, let's come over to... Oh yeah, we were working on food. How are we doing on food? We're doing... Oh, we're not doing good. Um, okay, you're gonna drown. Good, that's gonna give us more food. How many eggs do we got? You're cooking some eggs. You're cooking some eggs. Here. Okay, so, well, let's let's hope um, we can do okay on food. I'm not sure what happened with our food situation. It's like we just stopped growing everything. We definitely need more food. Uh, we're going to work on that. Yeah, I mean, some of the quickest food we could get would be grub fruit. Uh, let's quickly come over here to Yucklem. Yuckalin. Because we got to see what's going on over here, too. Um, make sure these guys are okay. You guys are sleeping. We're not 100% stressed. That's all right. So we got a little bit of food. That's good. <clears throat> um, what are we doing over here? I completely forget. Okay, we were building up here to see what's up there. We're building down here to get down to this. Um... You know, we're we're just we're just kind of doing stuff is what we're doing, but we haven't really done 
anything per se. You know, old volcano. It's more of just exploration right now is what it is. That's the iron volcano. Um, okay, well, they're not starving. They're not panicking yet. They are slowly getting things repaired from the damage done earlier. Um, it doesn't look like we have any concern about potential death. But we'll watch it. Alright, good. So this cools all of this area down. It's still hot. Let's get rid of these ro hot rocks here. Because uh, these hot rocks are making a mess of things. Yeah, all the hot rocks are hot. Um, but anyways, that you know that that helps us cool this area down. It's not enough. Oh yeah, they're they're growing. All right, we're fine. And that's dumping the water down there, so that's fine. All right, uh, we got this thing. It's gonna be algae. Which is under organic. There we go. We're going to put algae. Uh, we'll have to get the rest of it built. <clears throat> Alright. Now, while that is doing that, I think it is only smart of us to continue finding more food choices. So the first thing that we're going to do is we are going to put in another grub fruit farm. Yes, we are. We're going to come up here. One, two, three, four, five, two, three, four. Or, <coughs> excuse me. One, two, three, four. There we go. <coughs> My goodness gracious. <coughs> Something got <coughs> in my throat. And it's saying, ha ah, going to make you cough and sputter and cough and sputter and sputter and cough. Now you'll notice I'm only making this three high. We are going to optimize space. We will automate, of course. go are you guys still too hot what's our temperature here 39 degrees is it because of all this rock do we need this i don't think we need any of this now oh, all right let's let's deconstruct 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 and there's some automation there too isn't there Deconstruct. That's all. Very good. Dig all this out. Um, let's also come over here and come through here and put this up. Yeah, I, I think that's good. We'll do the same thing here once we get the top of it. What is our air temperature coming in? It's at 48, so that's the problem. The same problem I have on most of my bases is eventual heat um, is getting too much. Yeah. How are we doing over here, guys? Suffocating. Uh, what are we... Oh, darn. Would you get out of there? My goodness gracious me. <laughs> uh, don't die on me. Come on, cycle change. Okay, well, he took his helmet off in the water. And this thing is having a problem because it's drowning from up here. What happened? Oh my goodness. That's what happened. Um, okay. <clears throat> we need to do that. I mean, 
It's fine. It's just dumping it all down there, but <laughs> it is causing a few problems. <laughs> What's on this power grid? Um, nothing. Okay, well then that's okay. <laughs> just this stuff. <clears throat> all right. Okay, so these things won't mind the heat. So they'll be fine and we'll start growing. So that's a positive. All right. And there we go. Perfect. All right, and we'll do a nice little sweepy weepy. And we're gonna have to come back through and put another one to co keep cooling this. But um, ideally we need to cool the water. I think that's the more important thing. Why did I put all these here? Oh yeah, because I was gonna pump it out, but we haven't built anything up here yet, so you know we're not pumping anything. All right, um, food slowly. They're trying to de-stress. It is going down, so that's good. They are successfully working on de-stressing themselves. Uh, we don't need any dupes right now. We'll just grab the ice. That's right. Perfect. You're surfing. That's good. How many critters? Eight. We got enough critters everywhere. All right, cool. So you guys keep working on that. Meanwhile, let's come over here and make sure that we're doing okay. Stress is going up through the roof again. All right. Well, probably because we need some nice living quarters. So I guess it's time to slowly build out <clears throat> a little extra, right? That would only make sense. Well, let's see. So if we, this is just a nice little area right here. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go boom, boom, and boom. Make two little rooms right here. There we go. Just a temporary little base area. <clears throat> Take that out. Take that out. We'll put in a little bedroom. A little dining hall. Otherwise, they're just going to continue to do stuff like this. So we need to start de-stressing these guys. If we're going to keep them here anyways. we got to make life better. Oxygen's fine. Uh, we do need to get some better food. Things like that. Speaking of food... Okay, so yeah. These guys can eat anything. It's fine. It's fine for right now. What I think I want to do is, uh, like you probably, if you've been watching my Ghibli colony, I have really focused on what food they're eating to help boost morale and not negate it. So we are going to slowly work towards that. These guys are going to be stressed for a while, but we're gonna we're gonna get them there. Um, <clears throat> did we get the machine active for coming here? Where is it? Here it is. This one is not active yet. So let's activate it. And I think we're going to send a bunch of uh, hole over here. All right. And, you know, start a power or, well... Does it have to be coal? What do we got the most of? Um, well, we're short on natural gas. Um, there's 
still running on plenty of hydrogen over here. I think I will automatically, though, do this really quick. Boom. And we might as well start trying to cool this stuff. Yeah. Because that's hot. <laughs> That's our biggest issue, is if we can cool down the whole place, then it'll be better. Okay, so this is, uh, this will start growing. Um, I will put in a field station so it becomes, it's recognized as a farm. Ceiling collapse. Okay, that's fine. <clears throat> Okay, so we're going to put a door here, door here, there, and then dig that out. You can also dig this out. Now we're going to come in and we're going to put some nice beds. Two, three, we're going to be able to do four, it looks like. Then we're going to be able to put in a little dining hall. There we go. So we'll let them build that. That's going to give start de-stressing them. That's the key here. Once we have this done, then we'll work on like a massage table and the power room. Yeah, we need we need power. Okay, so over here, where's our machine to send? Okay, so this is the receive. Where's the sender? I always forget where it's at. Um, There it is. All right, so... Allow manual use. <laughs> Let's run a quick wire straight over here. There we go. That in. And a little bit of flooring. There we go. <clears throat> All right. Awaiting hydrogen fuel. Let's get that built. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna work on cooling. Now this did cool down quite a bit. I'm gonna go ahead and put another ice chunk here. Just so that we can cool it down a little bit more. I'm gonna put one there too. And another one here. And one over here. We're gonna we're gonna work on this. I don't need this door here. So I'm going to put in well, I won't reach the inside. I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> because that'll stop the heat escaping through this. So we'll work on that as well. We've already got the ice here. Still don't have any mutant seeds. And then we can clean that up. Uh, all right, so let's so limit units. That's interesting. So if I just put it at one unit. Kitty, your head is in the way. I can't see the buttons on the screen. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll see what happens there. I'm hoping... I know we can get it to work. We just got to figure out how all of that works. <clears> hey, <throat> okay, we're cooling them down a little bit more. 32. I 
That's good. We got this built that'll stop the heat dispersal from up there. These are growing and being fertilized. Um, excellent. I don't think there's a whole lot of research we can do except for advanced stuff, but let's take a look. Oh yeah, we were working on this. We'll, we'll put it back. I don't think we can do it, but who knows? Maybe we'll be able to. All right. <clears throat> now, so one change we can make is that let, let's let let consumables. Okay. We do not want them to just eat the grub fruit. Sorry. You're just not doing it, guys. Right? And we're not going to eat the mush bars, and we're not going to eat the meal lice. And we're not going to make pickled meal. Because we can turn the pickled meal into mush rye and it's a zero for the morale, so that's good. Um, if we don't eat the grub fruit and we turn it only... Here, so we can see the rest. We turn it into roast grub fruit or, you know, stop it. Or this grub fruit. Um, that's better. Um, what does it take to make this stuff? Yeah, this takes the spindly grub fruit, the roasted. So if we can make the roasted, that gives us a plus one. So that's why we don't want to eat that. We're just going to roast it every time. Um, and then we can eat regular grub fruit if we had a thing, but we don't have a, have any regular grub fruit. Would you stop it? Man, this menu is... Um, I don't think we have any bristleberry because it's not growing down below, but if we don't eat it there, we can automatically turn it into gristleberry, which gives us a plus one. All right, so I'm gonna do that to start with. That's a, that's a little bit of a start on our food. So that's good, it's really good. All right. What's our temperature up here? It's still fairly warm, but we did cool it down. Now we can take out this rock. Let's get that taken care of. And then we wanted to grab a bunch of coal, which we can grab this. And once this is built, we can put consumable ore, coal, eight. We'll just say sweep only. Because we're going to sweep up the coal from over here. Okay, so no problem. We just got to get the power finished. So let's let's do a quick build on the power. Get that going. All right, now what's wrong with this? It's repair already. Why did it receive invalid? Receive damage from incorrect substance somehow. Okay. Well, that's fine. All right, so what's our temperature in this area? It's negative 31. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to take this. We're going to take this. We're going to take something with high thermal conductivity. We'll just use this. We're going to do that. Um, we probably... Well, we can get up there and we can get up here, so we should be fine. All right, so that'll be the start of cooling this, and then we got to get in here and just cool that area. All right. Cool, cool. Let's go ahead and do another sweep up the mess. Very good. And let's make sure we get this built for heat protection. Okay, so that should help us a lot in reducing our temperatures. Flashing out. Yes, I know. Let's let's come over here and see how we're doing. All right, you've got your beds. Let's go ahead and destruct stuff. Deconstruct. You're not going to sleep in any of these beds anymore. 
And you're not going to eat in any of these tables. Oh, time change. Come on, come on, you can do it. Sounds like the vacuum is trying to vacuum something up that it probably shouldn't. The little robot vacuum is going around the floor. This isn't storing anything. Deconstruct. Let's get ready for some power. All right. So we're going to get a full generator. We're going to stick. We want it on a smart battery. So we're going to stick it there. We need some metals over here. What's wrong with you? Chili surroundings, soggy feet. Here. Move to here. At least you could be a little bit happier. Yes. Pound the ground. That is the way to do it. Okay, put some of these in. There you go. Then we're going to get a little storage bin. Uh, we're just going to stick them right here, three storage bins, so that we can pick all this stuff up. There, see, now you have a mallow plant. We're going to try to get you guys some some reprieve here, very carefully. There we go. Okay. So that gives us a little bit of that to help us out. Um... Dig this out, guys. Alright, so let's come back over here because we need materials. So that, that means we also need to come over here. We need to come down to refined metal. And we're just going to send over some, some copper. There we go. Alright, so all I have to do is pick stuff up. Because I've got it on sweep only. Alright. So, sweep, 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 this is the long, I, again, I wish there was a way to click the sweep command, select what you want to sweep, like of a, a resource, and then just cover an area. coal here too. Oh, and there's probably a piece here too. There always is. There it is. Sweet. Okay, now I'm hoping they are good. They're they're sending it over here. Now I need some copper. Some some metal. Where do I have copper? I'm going to change this from sweep. We're just... Yeah. Let's get some, some raw... Raw copper! Is it over here? There it is. Sweep nine. So actually we can, we can just use sweep one still. Okay. Alright. So that got us... A thousand kilograms of coal so far. Not much. But it's a start. I tell ya, it's a start. I'm just gonna put... Okay. And then we're gonna do this. There we go. Just this area, guys. Let's let's put it sweep only. Sweep only. So they'll only pick up what I tell them to pick up. There we go. Awesome. Alright, well, I think that completes this episode. We are making progress. We have a long ways more to go. We gotta get our metal over here. Um, which we will get. Since we went ahead and, hey, just pick up a bunch of this copper, send it over there from the volcano. 
we've got this in the works. Um, so that is good too. There we go. So let me see. It's coming out at 45, going out at negative. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, well, that's a little cold, I think. <clears throat> but for now, we're going to let it come into the base. Um, yeah. A and it'll start cooling these areas down. So I'm okay with that for now. <laughs> All right, and we'll continue to build up our food over here. This farm will help temporarily, but we'll get our other farms going, and we'll start making better food, and we're going to be redoing some stuff, and we'll see what this is in the next episode. Thanks for joining me, everybody. Take care.